The show exhibits very poignant remarks made by the ambassador to the UK. I think one thing I, I take away from that is the word listen. I think that should be followed up with learning. Learning about other cultures is vital uh, to combating this polarized world. Uh, the Meridian Center for Cultural Diplomacy is proud uh, to uh, inherit that mission of using culture to bring countries together. Uh, we feel it's that neutral platform where people can learn about one another, and through education, uh, you can break down barriers. Uh, many of you are familiar with our programs. Uh, we do exhibitions, cultural exchange programs, artist residencies, film screenings, artist talks, and more. It's my honor today to present to you a wonderful exhibition that we curated with the United Arab Emirates, the embassy here in Washington. It's an exhibition of contemporary art telling the story of contemporary life in the United Arab Emirates, and it's intended to educate Americans about life there and creating a, uh, differences between them and their neighbors. We exhibited this in Washington, D.C. in 2014 uh, with related programs, educational tours, artist delegations. Uh, this was followed by a six-venue tour throughout the United States in which, again, artists traveled to places like East Lansing, Michigan, Spokane, Washington, Los Angeles, Chicago, University of Kentucky, all the while educating Americans, young Americans and old, uh, the importance of culture and understanding one another. Uh, it's my pleasure to introduce a video that will highlight some of the more tangible impact of that particular tour. Thank you for coming, and we'll see you hopefully tonight. The show exhibits over 50 artworks by 25 artists. The story of the show it encompasses the idea of both the past and the future of the UAE. The works are diverse in their mediums, from photography, sculpture, to painting and illustrations. The works tell the story of the Emirates, tell the story of the people, its heritage in a contemporary context. It's important that uh, people understand our history through uh, the art they are seeing here in Pass Forward. Uh, we have, uh, I think, around like three generations of artists here. Uh, so it's good to see how we started. Uh, it's good to see the mix between established and emerging artists. Art has always been at the root of Emirati society. Art has nourished our culture, informed our thinking, and allowed the UAE to become the modern, open, tolerant country that it is today. And so Meridian's work, and what we try to do, is work with our embassies and the embassies of our partners and allies, like the UAE, to try to build bridges. Being able to, to come and meet a lot of uh, people from the United States, to looking at my work, and it turns out that it speaks to a lot of people, and that really was eye-opening for me as well. And so this exhibition is particularly important because it's showing this rapid change and growth in the Emirates. It's showing how artists respond to change. And exchanges like these, um, they break down stereotypes. I mean, I think that's more important than anything else is that people have a certain idea about what Arabic culture is like and what people are like in the Middle East and you meet these people and it just destroys any kind of stereotype that you have. I think the artists get a lot out of this program because they're able to exhibit their art abroad. Um, it's an opportunity for them to be able to come here, talk about their art, um, as well as appreciate um, what the United States is all about. But at the same time, it's an opportunity um, to highlight the similarities between the two countries. Fast Forward is more than just uh, an art exhibition. It's a way to connect our cultures and share the UAE uh, story with our fellow Americans. It is wonderful how art can communicate uh, those ideas to become a universal language. I think the real impact is education and mm -hmm. it, it's, 
You know, everyone has an idea of what they think someone is. Uh, you have these misconceptions. Um, and I think through education, you begin to open your mind a little bit about, hey, well, those people are just like us. They share the same values. So although we live in different cultures, in different societies, and in different continents, we have the same kinds of cultures, the same kinds of aspirations from our young people, and I think that that's really powerful.